Also, if you like what you see and you want to support my channel, then the best and easiest way you can do that is by simply smashing that like button. By doing so, you show YouTube that you enjoy the content that I produce. So YouTube puts my video where more people can see it. It's a small task for you, but it means so much to my channel. And if you want to see more videos like this one, simply subscribe. Ring that bell and you'll be notified as soon as I put out another video. Thank you. Hi everyone, Silver Joker here. Okay, so here we are again. If you are a long-term stacker, or if you've been stacking for any length of time, then you know that uh, this is just part of the course. Silver is down. Today is Sunday, August 13th. Right now, silver is at 22.75 an ounce. That's spot price. That's not with the premiums and all that. You buy physical silver, you know that 22.75 is not where you're gonna buy silver at. But anyway, that's where we are. It's going to go like this throughout the entire time you stack physical silver. So today I'm going to do some rare price predictions, which I never do. <laughs> so, you know, these are just predictions based on some of the information that I read and that I study and some of the circles that I you know, maneuver through. Before we get into that, before I give you my predictions for the rest of the year, let's just talk about the importance of value over price. Now, if you watch my channel, if you follow me at all, you know exactly where I stand on that. So your value comes from what you feel physical silver can do for you now and in the future. Price is what you have to pay to get it. Now, your willingness to pay that price is going to be based on your value, how you see physical silver helping you or aiding you with your financial goals and your financial strategy. So price is going to change absolutely going to change your value if you value silver for what it's going to do for you i believe that's going to continue to be the case at least that's the way i see it right you know what your goals are you know what you expect physical silver to do for you and if those goals are realistic if your expectations of what physical silver can do for you are realistic then i don't believe your value is going to change the value that you place on it okay so here we are we're at $22.75. Back earlier in the year, silver was up around $25, even a little higher. All right, so have you lost any, has your silver lost any weight because spot price dipped? I mean, is that ounce any less of an ounce because spot price went down? Well, of course it's not. So that ounce is always going to be what an ounce is valued at. If spot price goes down a couple dollars or a few cents. You haven't lost any weight in your ounces, it's still an ounce. So if silver goes up to $25 an ounce, as long as you have that ounce, you can take advantage of that price point. But if you've watched my videos in the past, I'm starting to sound like a broken record, so I won't go back there. You know where I stand on that. You got to have silver in order to take advantage of wherever silver price goes. It may dip, there's, there's of course there's hills and valleys that's gonna be in silver's movement, but it's always gonna go up, it's down, and it's up, it's down, and it goes up. You just have to be patient enough to get it when the price is at a point that is favorable to you and what your goals are. All right, so like I said, it's gonna be a rare prediction on my part today, and I will leave a link in the description to some of the places that I visit and how I come up with my own personal predictions that I make to close family and friends, but today I'm going to share these predictions with you okay <laughs> like i said short video today so we're going to get right into this so where is silver going well i believe that we're going to see at least a 25 to 26 dollar on silver spot price this year i don't believe we're going to get too much higher than that we may dip our toe in at 27 dollars an ounce but i think that's going to be the max for this year now I base that on a lot of the things I've read, the people that I talk to, and just basically, you know, keeping an eye on what's going on around me. Of course, there is some anxiety out there. There is some worry, and people are a little, a little nervous. They're being a little more conservative with their cash, as far as I'm concerned, and what I see. So I don't believe silver is going to go too much higher this year. So how low will we go? Well, <laughs> you know, look, I'm just telling you this is my personal opinion. Don't think that I'm saying and I'm wanting this to happen, but this is what I see. I see the possibility that we can see maybe $16 an ounce silver spot price. 
I see the lows being close to $16. Maybe we'll hit $16, but I don't think it'll go too much lower than that. Maybe $16.75, $16.50 this year for a low. I think that'll be the lowest that we go. And, um, you know, like I'm saying, to me, if silver goes that low, it's it's Black Friday as far as I'm concerned. If silver spot price goes that low, then the premiums will dip. But I don't sell silver, so <laughs> I don't know. But I got a feeling that if it goes down that low, then the premiums are going to be reflective of that dip. And so we'll be able to stack more silver because it will eventually go back up. We all know that. If you stack silver, you know that. So anyway, I'm not going to go too much longer than that. I mean, those are my predictions. I'm predicting maybe at the height, $27 an ounce spot price for silver this year. At the absolute bottom, the lowest, I'm going to say $16.50 to $16.75 for a low this year. Now, we'll see how accurate I am with that. How will I come up with a predictive price? <laughs> of course, these are my opinions. Uh, believe me, there's a lot of people, everybody you talk to is probably going to have a different idea about where physical silver is going to go. But those are my predictions based on just some of the information that I read and have read. And I'll leave a link to some of those places in the description so you can go check them out for yourself and check the accuracy of my predictions. Anyway, I'm working on a project for you guys. I think you're going to be very interested. I'm excited about it. And I'll share that with you in upcoming videos. I ordered some silver. I've been ordering silver like crazy. When that, I've been ordering online and I've been buying from my local corner stores. And when I kind of accumulate all that together, then we'll do a video and I'll show you guys what I picked up. And I'm going to share more of my private collection with you guys. Some of the things that I collect. This is not stack. This is collection. Like the Queen's Beast that I showed you guys in the last video. That is collection. That's not stack. I don't plan on selling that for any reason. Those are the things that I really enjoy collecting. And hopefully the people that are going to be left with those will have the same enthusiasm about them. But if not, I won't be here, so it won't really matter. <laughs> but I enjoy collecting it now, and I enjoy sharing that with you. So more of that coming up. And, you know, we're just going to keep the silver train rolling. Uh, not a lot to talk about today. Just gave you guys my predictions. I appreciate you guys uh, giving me your attention today. You know, have a good Sunday. Keep stacking.